Dear Shenhua, my work is done. The Phoenix entrusted to our people is now complete. The time of destiny has come. Go with the one who holds the Phoenix, Shenhua, and find the proof. Yield yourself to the light and go together. I shall give you the family treasure, the Sword of Seven Stars. Think of the sword as a part of me and keep it with you. I shall always watch over you. What the? Leo. Right. Dragon and a phoenix. Just like the mirrors. So this is what he was working on. From a distant land in the east, from across the sea, he shall appear. He does not know of the strength hidden within him. The strength that would destroy him. The strength that would fulfill his wishes. When he is ready, he shall seek me out. And we shall brave together the rocky path. I shall wait. This encounter has been my destiny since ancient times. A dragon shall emerge from the earth, and dark clouds shall obscure the heavens. A phoenix shall descend from above. Its wings will create a purple wind. In the midst of the pitch black night, a morning star shall glisten, alone. What is that poem? It has been told in the village since long ago. The one who holds the phoenix. That's Bailu Village. We might find some clues about my father there. Let's go. Sure. Hey, Shenhua. We have to get to the village. Let's go. Do you have any idea where your father might have gone? No, I don't. Hmm. Has this ever happened before? With my father? Yeah. Has he ever disappeared without telling you? No, never. I see. 
Are you certain that letter from the cave was... It's his handwriting, without a doubt. Okay. Are you sure it didn't contain any clues? Uh... Shenhua? I don't know. Honestly, I don't care about the letter. I just want to find my father. I understand. Hello, Liu. Xinhua, who's this? This is Liu. He saved me from drowning in the river. <clears throat> Did something happen? A group of thugs tore through here two days ago. Oh no, really? Yeah, the kind we don't normally see around here. Let's... Keep moving. Hey, Shenhua. What's the matter? Does the village usually have gatekeepers? No. There's no need for them. Bailu is a very peaceful place. Are you sure about that? Because they said some thugs came by. Yes, but it sounds like they're not from around here. Still, that's worrying. Even for you? Yeah. I admit, I'm a little unsettled myself. The village feels different somehow. I can imagine. Let's ask around for some clues. Let's go. That was a pretty old bridge. Indeed. That's the Verdant Bridge. That's what it's called. Yes. It's been in Bailu for a while. Is that the village? Up ahead? Yes. Everyone lives up ahead. We can ask around. Someone's bound to know something. Let's not waste another second. with Shenhua.
I'm sure we'll find out more about your father. Thanks. You investigate here, Leo. I'll try another settlement. Hi there. Aha! Come to apprentice under me, have you? Oh, nothing. Fear not, for I am the great Suza Xiong. I can forge a formidable master out of the most hopeless of pupils. You stand before a Chun Tai cheer master. Um, yeah, I'm good, thanks. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? Do I look like I'd know anything about that? Right. Come by any time if you've got any burning questions about the great Chun Tai Chi. Will do. Do you have a moment? Do you know Mr. Yuan? Wouldn't say I'm proud of it or anything, but I don't exactly know many people around here. I see. I need help with something. What do you want? I'm looking for someone named Yuan. No, I haven't. Not since I saw him go to that house over there, but that was a while ago. Okay, thanks. Do you have a moment? Huh? What is it? Excuse me. Huh? What is it? I don't like the looks of you. Uh, okay. Excuse me. What do you want? Don't get all cozy with me. Sorry to bother you. Hello? Uh, I guess nobody's home. Is anyone there? Uh, it seems nobody's home. Let's have a look around here first. Hello? Uh, it seems nobody's home. Excuse me. What is it? Have you seen Mr. Yuan? He occasionally came to visit Joe next door, but Joe is likely working right now. Maybe Joe's daughter Lean knows where he is. I see. Do you have a moment? Do you know Mr. Yuan? He occasionally came to visit Joe next door, but Joe is likely working right now. Got it. Thanks a lot. Hey there. Yeah? That looks great. <laughs> yep, Shenhua tells me that too. You know Shenhua? She's my friend. Is she your friend too? <laughs> yeah, she is. 
say, do you know Mr. Yun? He's a stonemason. A stonemason? Just like my daddy? Your dad is a stonemason as well? Yep. Can I talk to him? Uh-huh. He comes home at 7 at night. He does. Okay. Thanks. Mm-hmm. No problem. I need help with something. What do you want? I'm looking for someone named Yuan. What's your involvement in this? I can't say. I have nothing to say to a stranger. I could use your help with something. <laughs> I have nothing to say to a stranger. Thanks anyway. I just have a question. Have you seen Mr. Yun? Where did you come from, young man? What? There's always something interesting coming in from the Lijiang River. I wonder what's going to show up next. Hey, do you know Mr. Yun? Hmm. Now where could he have gone to? Right. I'll give it a try. I'll give it a try. This one is interesting. This is cool. I 
I see. Hey. What is it, dear? I've got a question. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? I'm sorry, dear, but could you save that for later? This is no place for idle chit-chat. Pardon me. Um... I need your help with something. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? I'm not supposed to be talking right now. My master says I have to practice more. I'm looking for him. Go ask one of the other kids running around. Okay then. I need help with something. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? No idea. All I care about is martial arts. Okay then. I'll give it a try. A game can't hurt.
This is great. This is... Guess I'll take it. Get rich quick? Are herbs really worth that much? Guess I'll take it. Hi there. I've heard about you. You're Shenhua's friend, aren't you? The name's Hazuki. Oh, ho ho! You look strong. Um. A young man like you needs a snake power. It's a bottle of snake power. Why this? Deadly snake venom fermented for three months. It's just one of the medicines that'll help you in battle. It'll fix you up good. I see, I think. I always sell it here at my shop in case you forget. Have you seen Mr. Yuan? No, I haven't. Isn't Xinhua with you? We split up to look for him. I'm worried about that guy. Let me know if you find him. Right. Excuse me. What is it? There's something I want. What's that? Oh, changed your mind? No. Excuse me. What is it? I hear I can earn some money here. If you're chopping, I'm paying. Chopping wood? Yeah. Will you do it? This is good work. No, 
I'm good. Well, I ain't forcing you to do anything. The job will be waiting for you. Hello? Uh. Hey, bud. Bud, over here. You can't play unless you buy some tokens. Okay. Buy some tokens if you want to play. Lucky hit. Hi there. I do. Buy some tokens if you want to play. It's ten. You're on for one hundred tokens. How many do you want? Thank you. You can exchange tokens for prizes, so be sure to head to the prize exchange after. You can then take your prizes to the pawn shop and sell them, so more tokens means more money. Good luck out there. Excuse me. Hello there, welcome. Care for some lucky hit? This is Circle One. No, thanks. I'd rather you play than talk. Circle One is so much fun. Not right now. You're not going to play? I'm heartbroken. This is... Hi there! Do you have your eyes on one? Or on me? <laughs> How much are you betting? fun if you quit already. Just one more. Do you have your eyes on one? Or on me? <laughs> Step right up. How much are you betting? A man shouldn't back down. You're not done, are you? Not now. Come again soon. Excuse me. 
Huh? You talking to me? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wanna have a drink with me? It's going on your tab, laddie. Seems like you've already had a few. I'm just having a good time. I'm not drunk. Who said that? Hey. Hey, bro. Come to play? I recommend Bailu Village's own turtle racing. Make the right bet and quadruple your earnings. Easy money. I see. Turtle races, huh? Hey, here to play? I recommend Bailu Village's own turtle racing. How much will you put down? Which turtle will it be? Nice, bro. Go again. I'll come back. Roll it on Hi there. Hello there. Would you like to play some dice? The rules are simple. Roll a bigger number than me, and you win. I see. Win, and you double up. Wager it all and win big. Okay. Dice. How about a game of roll it on top? Place your bet. How much will it be? My turn. Total of six. Who knows how this will turn out? Total of five. My apologies. You can still come back. Will you keep playing? Place your bet. How much will it be? My turn. Total of eight. It's not looking good. Love eight. My apologies. You can still come back. Will you keep playing? Maybe some other time. See you then. Excuse me. You've only got one shot. Will you take it? No, thanks. Don't look so glum, chum. One shot will cheer you up. Not right now. If you say so, nothing lifts the spirits like a great game. It's here too. Come one, come all. All right, pick your platform.
What are you betting? you've got there. How about another round? Not now. Stop by again sometime. Pardon me. Yo! Need some tokens? Not right now. Listen, you can't beat me. Sorry, what? My exchange rate ain't budging, so smile, nod, and buy your tokens. Uh, okay. Hi there. Buy some tokens if you want to play. I'm all set. Come again. I should talk to more people around here. Pardon me. Who's there? May I talk to you for a moment? What is it? Oh, hi, mister. You know this man? He's my friend, Daddy. Well, get to it. I haven't seen Yuen around. If you know anything, I'd... Huh? What happened? Some thugs I'd never seen before showed up and wrecked my place. Thugs, huh? Why would they do this? It's me. They asked if I was a stonemason, so I said yes. And they just went crazy. Why stonemasons? They were definitely looking for something. What did they look like? Well, they weren't from around here, that's for sure. There were two of them. One had a shaved head with a tattoo on it. Don't tell me. They went to Yuen's place too? I don't know. Yuen was in the quarry when he disappeared. You're kidding. Those thugs might have something to do with that, too. Maybe. I'll be sure to tell Shenhua. Bye-bye, mister! Bye! It's gotten so dark. Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. This is the wrong way. 
I should head back. Excuse me. Hey there, lad. How about a game? Do you have a moment? It costs ten euron to play. You open your wallet, or I shut my mouth. <laughs> pale toss? Wanna try pale toss? Thanks. Aim carefully. That was all right. Want to go again? Thanks. Aim carefully. Oh, you can't stop like this. Try again. Thanks. Aim carefully. That was all right. Want to go again? Thanks. Aim carefully.
that was all right. Wanna go again? Oh, is it closing time already? We're all done for today. Anything new, y'all? Not about your father, no. I see. It seems that the thugs invaded Mr. Joe's home, though. Joe, you mean Ling's house? They must have my father then. We shouldn't jump to conclusions. I'm going with you tomorrow. One? I can't stop thinking about these thugs. I want to know more. All right then. We'll go together. Good. Yeah? I've been thinking about the thugs that went to Ling's house. And? I don't think it was a coincidence. I'm with you. They must have had a reason. Let's talk to the villagers together tomorrow. Okay. I want to ask some questions of my own. Hey, Xinhua. What is it, Liao? Did your father say anything to you? You know, before he left? No, nothing. But that wasn't unusual. Hmm. Okay. Although... Although what? Now that I think about it, he turned back to look at me several times as he headed for the cave. Interesting. Maybe... he had a feeling he wouldn't be coming back. There's a scroll. Doubt I'd understand it anyway. This is Shenhua's room. Shenhua's 
Shenhua's flute. It was made out of wood from the Shenmu tree, wasn't it? Sunflower seeds? What are they doing here? Doesn't look like a book I'd read. Tools used to cut stone. There are so many types. These are a stonemason's tools. Thank you. 